friends welcome to my youtube channel smart led lcd tv repairing in today video i will show you panels scalar voltages t cone voltages and all the voltages present in panel of an led or lcd so friends subscribe my channel like and share my videos so also hit the bell icon so you get my all new videos friends come back to video Today I will explain all the voltages used in panel of LED and LCDs. This is a scalar PCB. There are two types of friends panels. One is with T cone and one is without T cone. Some have T cone like this from main board. Friends, this is main board. Signal come from here LVDS cable and goes into the scalar PCB and in some cases it is bit the T cone is between them. So the signal comes here. Look at this. This LVDS cable is other so it will not fix it here. Signal come here and this these cables are used to goes to panel side like this. It is here. So I will explain both cases today and how much voltages are there. I will explain it by this figure. There are two cases, one with T cone and one without T cone. So I will ex I will explain both. Main board friends here, 12 volt or 5 volt in some cases go from here. There is T cone, it goes directly DC into DC to DC IC it will generate these voltages friends VCOM, VGL, VGH, AVDD and VDD in some cases VDD is generated by a regulator and in many cases it is also generated by DC to DC IC this VDD goes into main IC on the T-cone and then into the panel scalar these all voltages go to the panel scalar and the other case is friend this main board here we get signal from LVD S cable and the signal goes directly into the panel scalar PCB here a DC to DC IC is present which generates all these voltages VCOM, AVDD, VGH, VGL friends I will explain these voltages one by one and check you and also check it on the panel scalar Friends, firstly, I will on this. <clears throat> Friends, this panel is broken, so uh, this is the scalar of this panel. I am just trying to explain it to you so that you can understand what types of voltages are there. Release the standby, friends power is on now oh, the board is okay friends the first voltage we will check is this v in or vcc basically 12 volt or 5 volt in small lcds friends if this vcc is not present the problem to your panel is no picture or display white in main cases the display is white so friends i will check it V in or VCC. Put the meter on 20 volt DC range. Friend, it is located near the fuse from LVDS cable directly. Put one probe on ground. And friends, here is VCC. As you can see, that friend. Here, friend. Sorry, friend. Power is off. I again power on. Look at meter, friends. It is showing 11.88 volts. It's a 12 volt panel. 
it is of 32 inch here its number is mt315 it is 32 inch panel I again check it show the meter kindly it is 11.88 volt so this is friends vcc or v in of the panel the next voltage i will explain is this one vdd it is typically 3.3 volt also used to generate 2.45 volts and 1.8 volts using regulators for main ic friends if it is not is not present the problem with your panel is display dark black with no picture your display will be dark or there is no picture now i will show you where is vdd look at this friend kindly focus it friends you can see vcc 3.3 volt is written here i will show you by meter show the meter look at this friends 3.3 volt approximately it is vcc sorry vdd it is about 3.3 volts the next voltage i will show you friends is avdd friend it is also called vda or vddda in some panels it is typically about 14 volt to 10 volt 20 20 volts it is also generated from DC to DC IC and goes to gamma IC for picture. Friends, if it is not available in some cases, the problem with your picture is blue, blue screen with no display or black screen with lines. So no time to check it. And look at the meter it is 14.8 volt approximately the next voltage i will show you is vgh vgh is used to it is friends from 20 volt to 35 volts and it also depends on panel it is used to switch on the panel cells and the display becomes visible friends if this voltage is not present the problem is no picture slow pictures and lines on screen friends i will now check it on scalar pcb for you sorry panel is 200 pc volt because it is voltage high than 20 volt Look at this friend, 32.4 volts. VGH is 32.4 volts in this case. Now friends, the last voltage of the panel is VGL. This is negative voltage friend. It is used to cut off the VGH cells which were powered on by VGH signals. Friends, if the VGL, VGL is missing, the picture the problem with your picture is no picture and slow motion and this voltage is about minus 5 volt to minus 8 volt in some cases it is also high or low but it is in negative friends i will check it for you and you can understand it better friends here is vgl kindly zoom it And there you can see the VG. Show the meter. Look at this friend, it is minus 6 volt. So friends, these all are 5 voltages used in panel scalar PCB R and T cone. In the T cone, these R voltages are also present. I will show you here. It is a T cone friends. Here is DC to DC IC and these are voltages are here 
here is VCC 1.8 volt it is VGH and where is v, VGL here is VDD AVDD and here is friends VGL so there is same concept in T-cone and without T-cone in look at friends I have take panels and scalar PCBs from LCDs broken LCDs just for explanation here LVDS in insert and there are DC to DC ICs in some cases there are two and many cases there are one so they will generate all the principle are same all principle are same so friends now I will show you a trick how to repair these friends if any one of these voltage is missing then there many chances there is problem in your DC to DC IC then if you have that same part number kindly replace it and your picture become okay but if you haven't this IC with same number and it is all it is possible that you have not the same number then there are two ways one is to use other scalar PCB like this and take a jumper from here if VGL is missing take VGL from here to here from this thin copper wire give also its 5 volt or 12 volt whichever it is and take VGL from here and your panel will become echo I will friend make a video on that also in which I will show panel bypass so that without even VGH or VGL is missing in your scalar PCB I will get it from other P scan scalar PCB and connect it with that and show you how to repair that friends the other problem with VGL and VGH is the there are some thin cracks lines here going to side coughs I will show you these are side coughs it has points VGL VGH and V com all points in many cases these tracks are broken from air corner like this if your panel is broken or some old then you have also to use this to search which voltage is missing if VGL VGL is missing take a jumper from here VGL and solder it here it has very thin points I think cannot be visible or if I can show you yes look at this one look at the thin dots here these are its point take data sheet from Google and then connect them but you have to be very careful if you do the wrong connection then your panel will be short so friends I hope you like my video this video is all about panel voltages and I have explained you all the voltages so kindly keep watching my videos and keep liking it and sharing it thanks friend goodbye then